we got in this Whirlpool freezer on top from a rental property um, and it's not cooling at all. Let's check it out. It's pretty though. Mmm, yummy. Nice little Whirlpool. Plug it on up. What you doing, honey girl? Holly. Let's see what it do. Let's see what is going on here. Somebody's been back here. Compressor's running. Let's put some gauges on it. I've been behind some people that leave caps off. I don't know why, or maybe they're just checking it, but no cap. All right, let's see what we got here. No Freon. And it's barely pumping. Let's see what it does when we unplug it. Hmm. All right, so I guess we better test this thing for a leak first, but it definitely did not pump down. It should pump down to almost 30 in a vacuum, very close. So let's see what it does. We'll pump it up, make sure we don't have a leak. Pump up the jams. All right. 200, we'll see what she does. Kinda stanky. Holly Wally, Tickle Girl. Yeah, Tickle Girl. Oh man, we got a leak. Yep. It's dropped. Bet you I know where it is.
tiniest little leak. All right, so the story now is it, it come from a customer's rental property and he needs it back like ASAP. Well, now that we need an evaporator motor because you cannot solder on the aluminum. It is so thin. You could just about bend it with your fingers. We're gonna patch it for him so he can get it back to the customer and then we're gonna order the evaporator and probably change it eventually. I have had these evaporators last with the JB Weld on there for a long time, but they needed ASAP, so we're gonna do it real quick. Hang tight. All right, if you've never used JB Weld before, you just take the two-part epoxy, mix it together, and you slather it on there. Um, back when the great global sickness was going around, we had trouble getting some of these evaporator coils, so we had to do what we had to do, and we patched them. They used to have this stuff called a Luma Weld, or they got the green stick. I've never been good with that stuff, but JB Weld, slap it on there, pull a little vacuum, let it cure, and it's been working. Let's give it a shot. It does not work on the high side, though. Had a, somebody tell me they tried it on the high side, don't do that. Just braze it, fix it properly. And obviously, if it's a big hole, it ain't gonna do it. It's got to be itty bitty like this, and it will last, usually. There was one in particular that I remember pretty good. Uh, it was an all-in-one refrigerator that had a leak in an evaporator. And I found the leak and fixed it, bec well, I patched it because we couldn't get the evaporator. About a year and a half or two years later, he come in and it was that unit and it had leaked again. So we ended up, were able to get it. So we cut it out, fixed it properly. So. Still holding the vacuum. Don't forget to hit the like and subscribe to the channel. We're on our way to 1100. We're almost there. Don't you want to get us over that 1100? One day later. Still in a vacuum. That's a good sign. Pump it up to about 200. Or maybe let's just do 150. Yeah, 150. 150. No bubbles. That's not how it goes, dummy. Y'all don't forget to hit the like and subscribe. We're on our way to 1100. Let's do it. Did it Oh, the little kid. 
peppers. Now, why do you need so many screws? It's literally plastic and styrofoam. And it's wedged in there. Come on. Thirty minutes later. Yep, we're still sitting over 150, so we're good. Let's pull a vacuum and gas it, and then they will be ready to go. Get it back before the holiday. Vacuum to suck it up again. All right. The Samsung jingle. Already coming down in town. Oh yeah, zero cold. Look at the smoke rolling out of there. Ooh. That's how you put a patch on an aluminum evaporator in a Whirlpool refrigerator. You do what you gotta do sometimes. And if you made it all the way through that video and you want to prove it, you have to put the keyword down in the comments to show everybody that you made it. And the keyword today is the MVP, JB Weld, baby. Gotta give it the weld. Thank y'all for watching. Have a great day. Hit it with that JB, baby. Woo! Thank y'all for watching. Have a great day.